So there's, there's something in uh, Facebook marketing and Instagram marketing that a lot of us don't really talk about in the uh, marketing world, which is called the frequency illusion. And the frequency illusion is uh, basically this phenomenon that everyone's experienced where you see someone or something or a service or a product, it could be a car, it could be a real estate agent, right? It could be a uh, certain you know hat or t-shirt that you wanted to buy for a while. And the frequency illusion basically is that you see it enough that it's seared into your mind and that's what they call branding. Right? So it creates this brand that you're hyper aware of over time. Well, the frequency illusion also uh, basically contributes towards people's buying decisions. Right? If they see an ad again and again, it builds familiarity, it builds trust, they see this brand, they see that person or the expert as the authority figure, right? whatever it might be. But there's a key element to that that a lot of people are forgetting which is the frequency illusion, it really only works if you are giving, typically for giving value. If you're not giving value and you're just taking or you're asking people to just buy, buy, buy or take a certain action that may not result in them getting value, right? Some sort of reciprocity on the other side, then it's not gonna work. Then you just become part of the noise, right? You just become a part of the billions of other ads, right? And on a daily basis right now, we see around 5,000 ads, 5,000 advertising messages a day. Now we remember only 50, and then we can recall by memory only four. This is a study recently done by a marketing advertising agency in New York with a certain university up there, and it's pretty uh, thought-provoking if you think about it. All of those ad messages, people are driving people to see those ads. They're spending a ton of money, a ton of energy and resources, right? To create those advertising messages, to get that marketing out. But out of 5,000, people can only remember, you know, basically 50, but they can only recall and actually say what they were, uh, about four of them. And if you're in marketing, if you're an entrepreneur, if you're in real estate, if you have a brokerage or you're a title rep or you're in the mortgage industry and you're running advertisements, I really want you to think and be thoughtful about the message. Do you have something to give, right? Are you giving something? If you want that frequency illusion to work of them seeing you again and again and retargeting those people, you can't just ask them to buy or work with you or take action to take that next step forward. You have to give them value. You have to teach. You have to show them or really be able to highlight what their next issue might be and then provide the solution. And then you can ask. So think about that when you're creating your campaigns. That frequency illusion of seeing you everywhere and creating the omnipresence, right? That kind of preframes you in someone's mind to truly be remembered, to be part of those four out of the 5,000 a day, you need to give significant value. So whatever you do in your marketing, whatever it might be, try and provide some reciprocity, give value and give back.